Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is about fixing the issue with a BSOD error. Your device ran into a problem and need to restart with stop code APC underscore index underscore mismatch. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, let me make you one thing very clear that the said error of APC index mismatch is occurred due to a failing power supply, CPU, RAM or there is a confliction with your display or audio drivers. So we will identify and fix out these issues one by one. So first of all, go ahead, turn off your PC, enter into the BIOS menu of your system and you will find the option of XMP profile. Disable XMP profile and if you have installed more than one RAM stick, I mean if you have two RAM stick, unplug one RAM stick as well as swap the RAM sticks in both the slots to make sure that your RAM is perfectly fine and working without any kind of issue. Once you have done these changes, start your system and check if you are still getting the BSOD error code APC index mismatch. If this failed to work out and if your RAM sticks are working perfectly fine, let's start with the advanced troubleshooting steps. At this point of time, you need to do a force restart of your system into the recovery environment. To do so, press and hold the power key of your PC or laptop to turn off your system. Press and hold the power key, wait for a few seconds and your system will completely turn off. Once your system turn off, again press the power key to start your system. And once the system starts, I mean once you are getting spinning circles in the display, again press and hold the power key to turn off your system completely. Now once your system turn off, again restart. Do this method 3 to 4 times and you will get a screen diagnosing your PC or preparing automatic updates. So that means you have done the steps correctly and wait for it to diagnosing your system. In the meantime, I will go ahead and proceed with the same instructions that I have told you right over here. So now if you have done it correctly, you will exactly see a screen like this. Exit and continue, troubleshoot, turn off your PC. You need to collect, select the option troubleshoot and then click on the option advanced options. Now from here, click on the option startup settings, then click on the option restart. Now at this point of time, you need to select the option 5 which is enable safe mode with networking. So you need to use the functions key F1 to F9 to choose the option. We need to choose the option 5, so you, I need to press the function key F5 to enable safe mode with networking. I will go ahead and proceed with it. So once your system restart into a safe mode, right click on your start menu and choose the option device manager. From here, you need to expand display adapter. At my end, it is showing only the one adapter. If you have more than one, you need to do the same steps which I am doing you right over here. Right click and choose the option properties. Click on driver tab over here and if rollback driver option is available, you need to choose the option rollback driver to roll back your display driver to a previously stable state that will help you fix out the issue of BSOD stop code APC index mismatch. Now if this method failed to work out, let us proceed with the next step. Go ahead and open your browser. You need to download a tool with the name DDU uninstaller. I will share the direct link of this website in the description of this video so that you can directly click on the link and download this tool. You need to download this one, DDU portable version so that you do not need to install this into a PC. Once downloaded, open the folder. I will go ahead and save it onto a desktop. Now open it and click on the option extract. Once extracted, open the extracted folder, right click on your display driver uninstaller and choose the option run as administrator. Once it is open, now here is the interface of DDU. Here are two options available, audio as well as GPU. You need to choose both the options one by one. First of all, select GPU and in the device type, it will automatically select your default GPU. Else on a drop down list, you can choose it as manually. After selecting the GPU, from here choose the option 
clean and restart. This will go ahead and completely uninstall your display drivers from your system. After uninstalling, now go ahead, open up your browser and from here you need to download your relevant drivers for your GPU. First one is for AMD, you do not need to worry anything, simply click on this option, download Windows driver. Save it into your system and once it is saved, run it and this will automatically detect your relevant drivers and install them into your PC. If you have an NVIDIA GPU, go ahead, here is the automatic driver updater for NVIDIA. Click on the link and click on the option download now to download this NVIDIA app into your system. Once the app related to AMD or NVIDIA is downloaded, you need to install this app into your system. After installing, it will auto detect and install the relevant drivers into your system. After downloading the drivers, restart your PC and this will completely fix out the issue of APX index mismatch. However, if this fail to work out, in next step, right in this DDU, instead of GPU, you need to select the option audio and drop down list, choose your Realtek device and choose the option clean and restart to completely uninstall audio drivers. Now, if you are using a laptop, you need to open the manufacturer website to download your audio drivers. And if you are using computer system, you need to download the relevant hardware website, which is generally of Realtek. You can easily open by opening up your browser and typing here, Realtek audio driver download. Here is the very first link, download it into your PC and then go ahead and install them into your system. And now if you are having issues while downloading or updating any kind of drivers, I have this dedicated tutorial over here. Here is the dedicated tutorial. I will share the link of this tutorial also in the description of this video. Simply watch it and update your drivers to the latest version to fix out the issue of BSOD stop code APC index mismatch. Now these are the simple fixes. If these methods or none of the methods help you fix out the issue, all you can do is to do a clean installation of Windows 11. Again, for that, I have a dedicated video to do a clean installation. You can simply search on the YouTube with my name or else here is the direct link. I will share again the link of this video also in the description of this video. This is a dedicated tutorial that will provide you a step by step guide on how to install Windows into your PC. Now after installing Windows also, the error is still there. The only reason behind the BSOD stop code APC index mismatch is due to a hardware failure. Either it is your power supply, your CPU or your RAM. So for that, you need to do few tests one by one. And for the test, here I have a tool, memtest86. Download this memtest into a system and run it to check if your hard disk or your RAM is properly working or not. This is a very good software. Simply download and use it in a pen drive to check the status of your hard disk. Another software I have is Crystal Disk Info. And in case of checking the status of your hard disk, I recommend to using this tool which is Crystal Disk Info. Download it, run it into your PC and this will tell you the status of your hard disk. All the links which I have shown you over here, I will share the link of each site in the description of this video. So you can easily click on the link, download the tool and check the status of your hard disk. So this is all about it friends. If you still face any kind of issue, comment below or simply join my discord channel whose link I will give you in the description of this video also. And if you like this video, I request you to please click the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.